Hello and welcome to another episode of All About Careers. Today we're going to be talking to Paul Mason, who works as a shipping clerk in the logistics department of a large international furniture retail company. Paul, could you briefly describe your job? I'll try. Basically, I'm in charge of processing the goods leaving the company's warehouse. This means I have to take care of everything from creating shipping documents, such as commercial invoices and bills of lading, to making sure that the outgoing shipments are packed and loaded correctly onto the lorries. I also have to track each shipment's delivery status and make sure it arrives at the customer's premises on time. Do you have to use any special equipment in your job? Yes, I regularly use scanners, postage machines and scales. And I occasionally have to drive a forklift truck. And what skills do you need in order to become a shipping clerk? The skills that you need include basic computer skills, communication skills and basic math skills. You also need to learn how to use the specific software that is used within the company or warehouse. Is the job physically demanding? Well, you have to get used to working in a noisy environment with lots of distractions. You should also be prepared to stand for long periods and lift items repeatedly. So it's not a job that will suit everyone, but I find that it's very rewarding. Thank you for taking the time to talk to us, Paul. It's a pleasure. You are now going to hear a series of multiple choice questions based on the dialogue. You should pause the video to give yourself time to answer. Question 1. Which department does Paul work in? A. The shipping department. B. The furniture department. C. The logistics department. The correct answer is C. The logistics department. Question 2. A bill of lading is A. A commercial invoice. B. A transport document. C. An export order. The correct answer is B. A transport document. Question 3. What does Paul sometimes have to drive? A. A lorry. B. A train. C. A forklift truck. The correct answer is C. A forklift truck. Question 4. What type of skills are not mentioned by Paul? A. Maths skills B. Computer skills C. Language skills The correct answer is C. Language skills Question 5. What does Paul say about his job? A. It's well paid B. Not everyone would like it C. He works long hours The correct answer is B. Not everyone would like it. If you enjoyed this video and want to do some more language activities, check out the 10-page PDF workbook, which you can download by clicking on the link below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel to get the latest updates.